Hi and welcome to my maths class. What happens with series and sequences is that sometimes the number patterns become more complicated and the questions are not as easy as simply substituting 3 out of 4. Let's take the following question. These questions are level 4 questions. They don't often come up in the exams but if you have a very tough exam paper this is the kind of questions you would get. Okay, they tell us that the first term is equal to 16, which means that A is equal to 16. But look at what they are giving us now. They are giving us an equation. They say the sum of the second and third term is equal to 12. So T2 plus T3 is equal to 12. When they give us an equation, the main thing to do is to get rid of of your TNs. So we use the formula. Now we know this is a geometric, so a TN formula is equal to A times R and minus 1. If we substitute our 2 into our N, we would have A times R. Plus, we now do the same thing with the 3. We got A times R to the power of 2 is equal to 12. Once we substitute the formula, you will see that you either end up with simultaneous equations or any form of algebra. In this case, what we're going to do is we're going to substitute 16 into our A's. So we have 16R plus 16R squared is equal to 12. We now have a trinomial. Now to solve the trinomial, you can either use the formula or you can use your brackets. If you are not familiar with how to solve for x at this stage, you need to go to your previous videos where we discuss algebraic expressions, where we discuss solve for x. You would find this under the revision of grade 11 work. So we have r is equal to minus 3 over 2 and we have r is equal to a half. Now look at the question. Did we answer the question? They want to know what is the sum of the first 10 terms. We didn't answer that. So we're going to do an SN. We have n is 10, we have a is 16. Because we have two r values, that means we have to do sn two times. So we're going to first do minus 3 over 2. Now we're using our formula and we are going to substitute our values. So we know that sn is equal to a into 1 minus r to the power of n over 1 minus r. It is our geometric formula, geometric series formula. So we have 16, open brackets, 1 minus, and then our R, for this one we're going to take minus 3 over 2. So we have minus, and then minus 3 over 2 to the power of 10, because they are asking us to calculate for the first 10 terms. To the power of 10, close brackets, all over 1 minus and then remember the r is minus 3 over 2. So you must remember that you have a minus and minus next to each other which makes it a plus. Then you're going to put it into your calculator. Your final answer is going to be minus 362,66. Now remember you have to do it twice. You've done r is minus 3 over 2. But you have to do r is equal to a half. So you have to also do this one. So we're going to take our formula again. Sn is equal to a 1 minus r to the power of n all over 1 minus r. 
So we have Sn is equal to 16 into 1 minus and then we have half to the power of 10 all over 1 minus a half. So our final answer is 31,97 or if you're leaving it in fraction form, it's 1023 all over 32. You need to do both because there were two R's. You have to do both R's. Thank you for watching.